Straight and tricky, straight and tricky, straight and tricky. I know that all the rumors ain't about to slow down They got ammunition loaded up in my hometown They got shooters in the city holding on to the rounds No serial your number so they will never be found But tell me what the fuck you think I'm worried about Drop you down in the city, I don't hurry out I will judge you when they call the executioner to kill you I ain't even gonna call the fucking jury out I ain't tripping cause I been there where they coming from I ain't sleeping, got a grip on it Second place talking crazy about the number one But I don't give a shit about it if I change, and I promise you I will, never be the same, I'm just trying to keep it real, yeah, you already know the deal, I'm trying to get a house in the hills with a view, couple car garage and a pool on the roof, I'm about to change and I owe it all to you, yeah, if I change from it. Faith in bullets though. It's easier to run out of bullets than it is faith. A man can't run out of faith though. People tell me that they lose faith in things all the time. Which I never really understood, but the way I see it. Maybe it's not that a man loses faith. Maybe faith loses him. Maybe faith is like the sun shining down into a field on a hot summer day. If you walk into the forest, the sunlight doesn't shine down on you as often. It shines down on you, but only in the places where the trees let it through. The further you wander into those woods, the darker it gets. 
eventually he's so deep into the goddamn bush that the sun don't shine through anymore. You know what they say though. Halfway is as far as you can walk into the woods. The other half you're walking out. Maybe that means that there's hope on the other side. Maybe faith is waiting to shine down on you when you come out the other end. What worries me is... When you reach that other end... Will God have already passed judgment? For what happened in the dark times? I don't know. That reminds me of something though. You know what my favorite part of the Bible is? King James Version. James 5.16 Confess your faults to one another and pray for one another that ye may be healed. The effectual, fervent prayer of a righteous man availeth much. You know what that means? That means all your shit can be swept away just like the dirt on the hood of my truck. That's why I like it so much.